Hi, this is Ryan with TechWise Academy. In this video, I'm gonna talk a little bit about the three main versions of Minecraft. We get this question a lot in our classes. So parents are asking if their kids can bring tablets to our classes, if that Minecraft will work, and sometimes kids and parents are not on the same page as far as which version of Minecraft that they need. So we're gonna go quick through that quickly today. Uh, if you're playing Minecraft on a Switch or an Xbox or um, any other tablet that you've downloaded, any devices, you're playing Minecraft Bedrock Edition. This is, um, this is also known as just Minecraft nowadays. Whenever you're playing it as an app, you are playing this version of Minecraft. And they've really developed this so that you can play with your friends quickly if your friend has a Switch and you have an Xbox. Uh, you can even play this on the PC as well. You can download this through the Windows Store as an app on Windows and you can do the same thing for your Mac. Um, but Bedrock Edition, uh, it requires a Microsoft Live account. Microsoft now owns Mojang, which is the original developers of Minecraft. And so you need this Microsoft Live account in order to play with your friends online. The original version of Minecraft that was developed way long ago was Minecraft Java Edition. It was written in the Java programming language. Uh, and you typically see the, the term Java with it when you're talking about this. Now you'll only find this version if you are playing Minecraft on a PC or on a Mac. Um, you have to download it specifically from their site and you can only play it on these platforms. Now the reason why your, your children may end up gra graduating to this version is that there are a lot more mods available and a lot more um, server configurations available for this version. They basically have said this is our, our code framework built in Java here world you can create your own things with the Java programming language and mod this version of Minecraft and that's what people have doing been doing for many many years and so that's why um, Minecraft Java Edition has a big following and then thirdly just released a few years ago is the Minecraft Education Edition you probably won't even have anything to do with this this is typically used in an academic setting and it allows us the students to be able to go through and like um, create some loops and do some math and, and build some different things and a lot of education applications within the Minecraft game itself. And so um, this one also requires, the only one of them that requires an annual license. So you'll have to renew that annually if you get this version. But like I said, you're probably not going to be using that version if your kids have that and, and want to play Minecraft at home. We encourage the use of Minecraft, it's like building with Legos, but in this open world, and, and sometimes parents don't really get that. That's not the type of game that I grew up with. The games that I grew up with, you, you, you beat the game, and, and Minecraft has a way that you can do that, but really, it's about creating and exploring and um, building uh, things out of redstone, which is like a circuit building diagram, or tool that you can use within Minecraft, and, and, and really, um, just seeing your kids creativity uh, let loose in this game. That's why we really like it. That's why we use it in our classes. Uh, the kids enjoy it and they're learning something at the same time. So hopefully this was helpful um, about the three different versions of Minecraft. Thanks.